One one. This one bunted right back to the pitcher. Hartman's going to go to first. And one down, but exactly what Sienna wanted. Runners in scoring position at second and third. And that's a smart play by Tony Ross. We talked about he's old school. Uh, played small ball early in the game. Uh, gave up his number four hitter right there to stay out of the double play, which would have been a perfect situation for the Mountaineers. Got a good bunt down and pushed the runners over. Now it's up to Jake Hall and Tim Carroll to come through and knock those runs in and tie the tie and this Jake ball game Hall, up. a guy that has eight RBI on the year, including one today, with a chance – to maybe bring in the go-ahead run. And Hartman leaves the breaking pitch out, excuse me, inside. It hangs on the inside. Mountaineers defensively, they've got the corners in. Going to go to the plate if it comes to them. Middle infield's playing deep. Probably going to go to first with their throw. Go ahead and give them the run on a ground ball at the middle. That pitch didn't miss by much. Some of the fans are a little uh, upset by that call. It looked like it stayed up to me. 2-0, oh, do you give him the green light here? I think you do. This might be the best pitch he sees the whole, whole at bat. And there was the fastball that was fouled back. So 2-1. Came off that a little bit, probably a little bit excited, opened up too soon. Good cut, good pitch to take a swing at. Fouled again, back to the screen. Just a shade late. Is Jay Call the right fielder? So if you're Kermit Smith here, you're right, Kenny. He's a little late on that last fastball. You want to maybe elevate the fastball a little bit here, go at him, knowing he was late. You could throw a breaking ball. Bad thing with a breaking ball, if it's not a good one, you're going to speed his bat up a little bit. And he may crush it. 2-2 Two -two on the way. And a swing and a miss, strike three. Well, that sure looked like he was looking for the breaking ball there, Kendall. He hit the fastball. He did not get a good swing at it at all. And that's five strikeouts, fans. Everyone in a nice word for Jack Cartman to battle back. Small pizza with any pizza purchase. Thank you to Mellow Mushroom for their support of Mountaineer Baseball. Two outs. Do or die time for Sienna. And the last hope, Tim Carroll, who has a couple of hits today for the Saints, takes a look at the first pitch. Inner edge, call the strike. Good change up there by Jack Hartman. Got to figure Carroll was looking for the fastball in that situation. Good off-speed pitch. Fooled him a little bit. Froze him in, in the batter's box. Oh one. one Just inside. We're square. Mountaineers trying to fend off the Saints. And sweep the two-game series. Inner edge called strike two. Tim Carroll didn't necessarily like it from the whole plate umpire, but the yeah. count is one ball and two strikes. And if I'm Kermit Smith, I'm coming right back in there again since he showed some displeasure on that. He's probably looking really, really hard for that pitch again. He's not going to let it go by. Oh, wow. 
Check swing. Did he go around? No. Pulled it back just in time. Good pitch there. Elevated fastball. That's really, really tough for a hitter to stay off of in a pressure situation. Good job by Carroll. He just bought himself another pitch to work with. Two balls, two strikes, two outs, top of the ninth. Just outside, we are full. And maybe a little close, too close to be taking if you're I, I'd get Tim ready Carroll. to say, Kendall, that, <laughs> if it's out there in that same spot again, I, I would be surprised if Carroll doesn't get rung up. He better protect it if that pitch comes down that outside corner again. He's been, pitcher's been getting that outside half all day. Hartman delivers a swing and a miss, and the Mountaineers win it 9-8. A four-run top of the eighth for Siena, not quite enough, and they're still searching for their first victory of the 2020 campaign. Nice finish by Siena. You know, they're hanging their heads. They're disappointed, and understandably so. They had a chance to win this ball game, and... You know, it's going to be a long bus ride wherever they're heading to next. But, you know, you got to find some positives of your coach, Rossi. I mean, they, they competed both games. They came back from deficits of three or four runs in 